No, I just want to say that, um, you know, it's so apparent that when you came out of school, right, and you, you had that win, <laughs> right, because that must have been a big decision in your family, right? That seems to be where your, you know, you know, you started building your your agency in in the greater world. Like you, you had to start earning money, right? You had to form relationships with all the people in your community so that you can get these mm -hmm. jobs. You had to get a job in a far off land, and then you went, "Well, I, I got one here. So if I do it here, maybe I can get one in Morocco. Maybe I can get one in Australia." Right? Mm -hmm. You had all these wins that built your confidence in yourself as a human that you could do anything. Super important there, point. Right? Super, super, super important point. And I'm so glad that you brought this up. Okay, I think that you can probably see at half an hour, 40 minutes of a conversation that I'm actually a really confident human being. I believe in what I say. I'm very passionate. I'm very outspoken. I mean, I know what I'm talking about. And I know that I know that I'm what I'm talking about. Well, how does that happen? How do you get like that? How does your kids get like that? Well, I'll, I'll give you the secret. I've been through a lot of really hard stuff. I've put myself in really difficult situations. And through that, I've built character. And character is something that is not often talked about enough. Now, once again, did I know how to do all of these things in the beginning? No, absolutely not. I fumbled my way through it. But every time I did, I got a little bit stronger and a little bit stronger, a little bit stronger. And when I say, I have traveled for 21 years straight. I don't mean that I went on vacation for 21 years straight. I mean, none of this was a vacation. I mean, driving, driving across Africa, if you want to learn patience, drive across Africa. I mean, that will teach you pa patience very, very fast. Um, all of these types of things, I've had to develop myself. Nothing was handed to me. Nothing was given to me. I had no backup. I mean, I've traveled through, let's take a completely different example. I've traveled through Iran by myself. I spent two weeks and I drove around Iran. I met someone and we struck up a deal and he was my guide and we drove around Iran. I've been to North Korea and Vietnam and all of these types of places. I mean, I had to do that all by myself. If I got myself into trouble, there was no one there. The Marines were not coming for me. I mean, my parents weren't there. There was no one I could call. I had to figure things out. And I can tell you that a lot of confidence that I have comes from the fact that I know you can drop me on any place, anywhere in the world. And by the end of the day, I will have a roof over my head. I will have a warm meal. I will probably have a beer in my hand. And I've probably got a couple of friends to have a laugh with. I know that because I've done that not once or twice or five times or 10 times, thousands of times, thousands. I know that through and through and through that I'm self-reliant, that I can take care of myself. Well, that's like really empowering, knowing that you can put yourself into difficult situations and you're not going to break down. You're not going to sit on the curb and cry or call for mommy. I mean, piece by piece, I figured out how to do these things and it made me a better human being. Not just a better teenager or a better 20 year old, something, but I mean, this affected my whole life. I am a better person. I am a better member of my community. I am a better husband because of this. I am a better father. I am a better business owner because of these types of things.